Hey everyone, this is Mark Phillip at Studica, and today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the Introduction to STEM 1 kit from Fisher Technic. So I'm going to open it up, show you a little bit of what's inside of it, and uh, hopefully give you a better idea of what this kit offers you. So the Fisher Technic Introduction to STEM 1 kit is designed for students in grades 2 to 4. It contains grade-specific standards-based curriculum and activities for introducing students to STEM-related concepts. Uh, using simple machines. Each uh, Fisher Technic kit is designed to be used in a class by two students at a time. So what I'll go ahead and do is hop in here, take off the plastic covering, and here on the front we have the front panel. And if you turn it over you get a list of all the parts that come in the kit. On the right side here you get a couple of the different things you can build with this kit. This is a warranty card. Uh, this is probably the most important piece when you first get into this. You want to make sure you read through the whole quick start guide. And I do want to note that this is a rough draft. This may not be exactly what you have in your kit, uh, but it will be something similar to this. Now, you want to read through this whole thing before you start building stuff because it's going to tell you exactly what's in the kit. It's also going to tell you where to download the curriculum from. So the curriculum will not actually come in the box here. The curriculum will be downloaded in a PDF form and you can print it off to use in your classroom. And to give you a quick idea of the curriculum, here's a draft version, so this is not final. Uh, it's roughly 110 pages. That's about the thickness of it right there. And basically it has lesson plans, has uh, has standards that are addressed within the curriculum, uh, it has grading rubrics, and yeah, pretty much everything you need to really teach a class using this kit. So you want to be sure you read through the quick start guide so that you can get the URL for that uh, curriculum there. Other things that the guide will go through are things such as how to properly maintain and organize your materials before you start building a project and once you're done with the project. Uh, it will also give you a section on how to identify different parts. So you can see the difference, say, between these two red items here. There's a 30 degree versus 60 degree slope on it. Uh, small details that you may not notice if you're using the kit, but it's important to read through this so that you can identify these differences and. Uh, be sure that you're putting together the, your models properly. And lastly, what the guide is going to go over, it's going to point you to a specific section of the curriculum on how to build a very simple model. So you can think of this almost as a tutorial to get you and your students familiar with how to use the Fisher Technic system. So it's going to be a very primitive model that you can do very quickly, but it's going to help you understand how to use Fisher Technic stuff and how to proceed from there. So you definitely want to make sure you read through the whole thing before you start building your models. So other things that we have in here are this uh, paper sheet with the windmills. Well, they're not really windmills, but they're your students will end up cutting these out and folding them over for the wind turbine lab. So that's what this piece is for here. Now this is the actual instruction manual. So this is an important uh, document, basically it's all the instructions on how to build the models in the kit. Now it's important to note that <clears throat> the book includes complete instructions for not just the models specifically addressed in the curriculum, but it also has additional models. So stuff that you're not going to find in the curriculum is also shown in here. And right here you can see that a uh, paper cutout for the windmill lab in use. So yeah, you get quite a lot in here that goes above and beyond the curriculum as well. And then lastly, we have all the different parts. And there's not too much to say about this. These are just all the parts that you'll actually be using uh, within the curriculum and the instruction manual. So underneath that we have more parts. And then that's it. So that about does it for the introduction to STEM 1 kit from Fisher Technic. 
If you're curious about pricing or you want to potentially buy a few of these kits for your classroom, maybe for yourself, you can find more information out at www.studica.com. We'll have a Fisher Technic link on our front page, which will bring you to all of these different offerings. So thank you for watching. Have a good day.